without any further ado, shall we reveal the car? Guess what? what? This car is actually yours. I bought you a car. Dude, this is your car. <laughs> this is your car. Serious? So what kind of car do you want? You guys are messing with me. No, this is, this is your car. Oh, damn. GT2 RS. All right, guys, we parked because I had to check out the GT2 RS. White, black, carbon hood. Absolutely gorgeous. Love it. Look at that carbon wing. Oh, there we go. Oh, valve's closed. Okay, guys, so uh, welcome back to the channel. Dave, say what's up. What's up, guys? So today is a big day. We're gonna reveal to you guys what the new supercar is for the channel, but we are here at the entrance of the Van Dusen Botanical Gardens where luxury supercar is held. And there are some special cars entering the show right now. So we're trying to capture them for you, such as the GT2 RS. We need to get over to um, a garage where we have the car hidden at the moment. We got to reveal this bad boy. I don't know how many people got it right, but I think some of you, some of you guessed the right answer. A lot of you were like way out to lunch, talking like hyper cars. You guys, look, it's, it's under half a million bucks. I don't have a million dollars to spend on a car, let alone some of you were like, yeah, buy the, what was it, the new Bugatti Devo, I mean, six million dollars. That car was pre-sold before Bugatti even unveiled it. Okay, here we go. We're getting close. Ooh, we got Alec Choi in the house. Okay, let's, let's go park on the street. Would you get out of the car? <laughs> what up guys? What up? We got Alec Choi in the hey, house. Choi. Look at these ridiculous sweatshirts he wears. I love it, you 40 year old man child. I am, I'm a child. Good to hey, see oh you, good, good to see you. See you. Uh, good hey, to see, what are we doing? Hold on. Oh, I just oh, pulled the tape. Wait, wait, what are we doing? Let's just do this. My, Mr. Hello. Matt, how are you, sir? Good, how are you? We missed you the last time. I know. You're what? Fishing. Fishing. Yeah. I seem to not understand what he was doing. There were no supercars. I, I'm there. not a fisherman, so. <laughs> we're gonna show everybody this car or what? Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it! Okay, let's bounce. He just rolled his window up on me. <laughs> yeah, I see them at the end of the lot over here. We still got Alec Choi with us. Oh, oh look at it. There it is, you guys. Big reveal coming. You ready for this? Oh, yeah. I mean, any, any guesses? I think you Ford Fiesta. <laughs> Get out of here. Ford Fiesta. Here we go. Dave, you excited? I'm stoked, dude. Any guesses what this is? I don't know if I'm driving it this time. I'm going on the insurance. You oh, told you me. think you, think you, you are, hey? You me last week. That's what you think. Let's do this. All right. What up, boys? Hey guys. How you doing? Good, how are you guys? Guys, any guesses? What's under the cover? Ooh, I am so excited. Huh. Okay, now that you're standing here, any guesses? Uh, actually, I thought an idea, but I don't. I don't recognize it at all. Look like a Ford GT to you? No. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a Bugatti Devo, right? Yeah, it's the Bugatti Devo. Okay, guys, here we go. We're gonna do the big unveil, but first of all, let me explain why. These two gentlemen are here. We got Mike Hall and Matt August from August Luxury Motor Cars. These are the guys we picked the car up from. If it wasn't for these two gentlemen, this wouldn't even be possible. We wanted to support a local business. There's plenty of great dealerships in you know, the province of BC to work with, but these guys have gone over, above, and beyond. They hooked it up, big time. And uh, they have everything you could ever want. So if you guys need a car, 
big or small, supercar, luxury, exotic, whatever it is, give these guys a shout. Link in description, family run business. Without any further ado, shall we reveal the car? I haven't told you what the car is. No, you haven't. You haven't told, you told Alec, didn't you? I didn't tell Alec anything. I don't know. He's anything. the last person who apparently now is vlogging. Um, you can, you can. <laughs> B-roll. B-roll. So the truth is you haven't told me. I, I, I think I have an idea because you've had a few things, but I don't want to say it. But no, you haven't told me. But you told me I could drive it. Okay, what do you That's think it is? What do you think it is based on honestly what we what I told uh, you? I mean, we talked about a 488. Yep. And we talked about a 360 drift car. True. But looking at it now, I honestly, I can only see the bottom of a black tire. Yeah. I, I don't know. You can't tell from that? <laughs> what kind of car guy are you? What Apparently, kind of? Not a big one. Not a big one. Okay, here's the deal. Yeah. This car, as you probably thought, I said, you know, I was going to let you drive it. Yep. Unfortunately, the insurance corporation of british columbia uh fought me on that right so i might be able to put you on the huracan but you can't go on this car i'm sorry this is going to be the latest greatest biggest nuts build for dde mm -hmm. um i'm just messing with you guess what? what this car is actually yours i bought you a car this has nothing to do with me seriously Dude, this is your car. <laughs> this is your car. Serious? So what kind of car do you want? What kind of car do you want? I want a manual. Hey? Yours. What kind of car do you want? What kind of car do you want? What, what kind of car do you want? I want a manual R8. Guys, will you show him a manual R8? Ta-da! I'm dead serious, bro. You guys are messing with me. No, this is this is your car. I've had the pleasure of driving supercars for the last six odd years. And you know what? It wouldn't be fair to me to hog everything on this channel. Dave, you put in a lot of work. You guys make, you, he makes all you guys laugh on a daily basis. He deserves his own supercar. So Dave, I present to you your very first supercar, my friend. I, I, don't, even, I don't even, I don't even Well, thank, I'll thank apologize you. for the fact that it's only the V8 right now. Oh, look at that, the key delivery right there. Woo. Dude, thank you. But this thing has, this thing has a sports exhaust on it. So, without so, without so, waiting any longer. Here's the thing, though. What? I've seen this car. Yeah. Because I went and looked at it two months ago. And yeah. then about a month ago, I was talking to Damon. I'm like, I want to get my first supercar. And he goes, you know the time's right. And I called Matt. And he's like, it's sold. And I was like, all right, whatever. I moved on. And people were asking me on the channel, asking me on Instagram. And I was like, I'll just wait till next year. Dave came to me and he was like, Damon, you know, DD starting to do okay to the point where I think I could take out enough to lease a car. Mm -hmm. And I'd like to get this R8 that, you know, the guys at August had, uh, I think it's in the right price point. Long story short, I go, you know what, dude, we've all been there. We start doing okay. We get all excited. We blow the money, yeah. right? Life lesson. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. I was like, we're old enough to know we shouldn't do that. All right. Save your money. Let's make a year goal that in a year from now, you'll get your first supercar. Yeah. And you <laughs> fell for it. I gave the hard sell, like, David Kiyosaki, like rich dad, poor dad, cash flow quadrants. You don't want to move your money into a, a depreciating asset. And Dave, you took the bait. Well, I honestly was like, you know what? That's fair. I just want to do work really hard and keep working and when the time's right. So, I was like, you got a but, baby, but, you but, got a family, you got a wife. I low, like, low key, I was like, mm, okay. You were, you were a little bit upset. A little bit. And here's why. You did it. So now, best of both worlds, bro. You can save your money, buy your baby food, and still drive your dream car. This is nuts, you guys. Thank you so much. Like, I don't show emotion a lot, but... Well, it's because nothing impresses you. No, this is impresses me. <laughs> that's, an ongoing, <laughs> that's an ongoing joke on the channel. Nothing impresses Dave. Not even when your friend buys you your first supercar. I'm impressed. <laughs> you, okay, Mr. Fryer, you did it. You impressed me. All right, so here's what I need from you now. Yeah. You need to get in the car and fire it up. <sighs> now, look, I was a little concerned. Yes. Yes. Good speaker. Good speaker, it, by the way. Good it speaker, is. But why is it? But listen, I was a little concerned. It's a 2009. I think this is like prehistoric sound systems in these cars, isn't it? It's actually oh, yeah. pretty good. Okay, well, you're ruining my plug. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> As you guys know, or if you don't know, Co Speakers has been a long term partner of ours, and they are sponsoring today's video for a very different reason not the one that's usual where they just want to sell speakers they're actually going to give us money to buy dave they're buying dave 
your very first set of wheels and tires for this. Seriously. Yeah, dude, this is DD, man. Ain't nothing staying stock. Cool. We're Thank not, you so much. not even Dave staying stock. We're gonna modify Dave. I'm getting hair plugs. <laughs> <laughs> So if you don't know about the Co Bluetooth wireless speaker, it's an amazing little device. It's on a huge discount for you guys. Links in the description. You'll want to go and pick one up to support both us at DDE, but more importantly, this specific video, Sport Dave guys. in his you know, quest to modify his first supercar now that he just got it. We're already going on the modification trend. You can pair this to any device that you like, an iPhone, a tablet, your laptop, whatever it is. You could actually watch DDE videos and listen to the sound through this so you can really hear the tire slayer. It's got a little x base sub at the bottom which gives you really good sound. It has an indoor-outdoor feature, scrolling volume. You can swipe left or right at the top to change songs. The best part is, is it just kicks ass for the money. It's like 69 bucks. Yeah. This is a $200 speaker, typically online. Pick one up, support DDE, and you're gonna love this. If you've bought one of these and you love it, Right, how much you love it because we've had so many people tell us they want it. Tons. Let's hear the car. You guys want to hear the car? Ready? All right, Dave. Oh, Holy! Amazing. It sounds awesome. Again? Woo! Naturally aspirated V8, baby. And you got the I'm gated shifter. So excited. Let's show us how that works. Throw it. Oh, listen to the clicky click. Oh, yeah. Do it again. Oh. Feels amazing. I'm almost positive that this car would sound better than the V10. It does. I know that. I think it sounds better than the V10. You want to take the Pepsi challenge? Right, I do. All right, get your car. All right. Well, we're waiting for uh, Alec Choi to bring his car around. Throw that, turn that on. Throw it into the uh, cup holder because it fits into cup holders. Mm -hmm. Do you, have yeah. your do you have your phone with you? Let me, let me pair it. Pair it up and play us something non-copyright, please. How's it sound? Amazing. Yeah, that's it. The volume's so easy to use. Like literally. Right. Crank it up. That's that little speaker. That sounds amazing. Whoa. Sounds awesome, you guys. We're gonna do the rev off. Fire it up, Dave. Okay, first, we're gonna go with the V10. Hit it, give me three revs. Okay, V8. Oh yeah, okay, V10 again. This one, this one. Killing it, dude. Okay, together, go. <laughs> we have a clear winner, and it's not you. Hey, hey. I already won something. Hey, That's today. Yeah, you've won two things, three things. You got wheels, yep. a supercar, yep. and you just won the sound off between V8 or R8. All right. V10. V8 wins over V10. I need a new exhaust, man. Somebody's got to hook me up. Listen, Alec Choi is not like you to complain, and you're just a sore loser. Relax, okay? <laughs> you guys, we got to take him for his inaugural drive. Look at this, right. dude. So I've never driven a manual R8 before. Ever? Never. Okay, well. Buckle up. Do we have insurance on the gearbox? Buckle Fun, up. boys. Buckle up. Yeah, hold on. Hold on. You're, you're in reverse. I know, I'm going backwards. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, that's how that works, guys. <laughs> Bro, what do you think? I love it. I haven't driven yet. I'm already in love. Listen, click that. Let's click it. Hold on. Listen to it. Oh, smooth. Woo. Give it. Give it in the parking lot. All right, let's go. Whoa! It actually kicked out a little. Hey, thank God this car's getting worse than it. That's right. <laughs> Look at you go, boy. It's a dead end. Sounds amazing. That sounds way by like 
Listen to I this. I was too lost in that gated shifter. Listen to this. Wait. Oh. oh. Yeah, you have to push down. Yeah. Here, it's all good. We'll get you Ready? there. Listen. I Anyways, love that. How satisfying is that? I might need one of these. Here we go. <laughs> People are already honking at you. Hey, that was a school zone, actually. Uh, no, it wasn't. I'm just joking. <laughs> so yeah, get on it. Give it a bit of gas. Here we go. Listen to this baby purr. Oh, sounds amazing. The V8 in this car sounds better than the V10. Whoa, listen to it. A couple more downshifts, we'll flip it around here. Then we really need to get this car over to the show, you guys. Oh, that tunnel? Yeah. You want to do it? Of course. Let's do it. Oh, my first ticket, my first supercar, <laughs> the first day I got it. In a tunnel. <laughs> Hammer it again here, you'll be able to get some good noise out of it. It's right here. Yeah. This is amazing. First to launch, you guys. Do it, Dave. Well, TC action yeah. there. Okay, now it's off. This spinning first? Oh, yeah. That's awesome. It's been so quiet, but I was like, I love the sound of the growl on the V8. You guys, smash that subscribe button. Give Dave a thumbs up on this video. Today is his first day of supercar ownership. I love it. <laughs> I'm speechless. I know, man. It's kind of like, it's kind of like, I mean, honestly, if someone bought me a car, <laughs> you know, like my mom did back in the day, I was pretty speechless. Well, I just took it and ran. When you first got your first supercar, which is the Gallardo. Yeah. What's, what was the experience like the first day? What'd you do? I was, as soon as the paperwork was done, I was super giddy. Yeah. I, I, got on the, I got on the ferry and drove home with my wife, Tasha, and we were just, we parked it at the ferry terminal and just got out and stared at it. Because from the inside, I mean, let's face it, even a Gallardo kind of just looks like a basic car. Yeah. But from the outside, from the outside, that's where you really feel like you've got supercar ownership when you're standing still or when you're moving, you have that sound like right now, you know? Well, bro, you well deserved, my Thanks, friend. Man. This is amazing. You're a good business partner. You're an even better friend. And uh, well, I'd say you're a better friend at this point for this. No, 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 no. <laughs> you put in a lot of work. You put in a lot of work before you ever got paid. Yeah. So this is kind of. Wait, wait, wait. I get paid now as well? <laughs> Don't push it. Ready? You ready? Ready for what? Ready? No, 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 no. Jeez, you're crazy. Need more I need more angle for Oh my god. More angle! Stop. Stop. I'm gonna take the keys away. <laughs> we did it? it, dude. How was it? Well, it's amazing. I mean look at the look at it. Look at the guy. Look I'm, at so, the I'm stoked for you guys. It's the best thing ever. Oh and Dave, look. Oh, it's huge. Huge. It is. I know now that we have that air tank in the front. <laughs> have you seen the front? No. The oh my front, gosh, please. come look at this. Hold on. Because usually it goes deeper, right? Oh, yeah. But the air tanks under all that stuff. You could fit in one pair of shoes or squished. The only thing that fits in here is the handmade Italian leather custom DD duffel that says DD here, DD here. And on the inside, look at this personalized. And everybody who gets these, they're all, we're only going to make 40 of these. Everybody's going to have their name personalized on the inside. These will be one off, only 40 sold. Oh, and they go on sale. When this video drops. Come when on. you guys see this video, these will be for sale. There'll be a link in description to the luxurious DD duffel. That's yeah. what I'm calling it. Like, only, do you tell how many there is? Only 40. Only 40. So, handmade in Italy. Yeah, handmade in Italy. You guys, whoever's lucky enough to get one of these. And I purposely uh, did it where it's just nice and clean embossing both on the uh, the long handle or the long strap and on the side of the bag and then customized on the inside. 
for the most part, it's just really clean and nice. So it's not a big, you know, like, it's not this pattern. We weren't gonna go there. In the future, if someone wants it done in this pattern, let me know, maybe we'll make one. You took your drive. We gotta sneak this into the show. I think this video is a wrap. I'm so grateful to the viewers as well that made this possible. You, you did it, but like without the channel, right? that never would happen. So thank you guys. Smash that subscribe button, click like, and turn on notifications. Don't miss a video. And go give, uh, go give these boys a follow on Instagram. Yes. August. August it's Luxury Motor Cars. It's just August Motor Cars on Instagram, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So just August Motor Cars we'll Instagram. Up. Add a tag right here. Be a little tag floating around on my head. Okay. You have to hit the camera. It doesn't turn off by itself.